is saturated in love when we dive deep into the vibration of love hope all is blessed in your world holy spirit thank you for the leo collective that's sun moon rising and venus shuffling now to gather the archetype of an individual this may pertain to okay collective message if it doesn't resonate feel free to schedule a personal reading at the number four love.info dear leo there's an old soul fire there you are and lastly we have crone an old soul a wise woman an older divine feminine energy peering through fire there you are passionate there you are lit some are angered oh the leo let's get more holy spirit thank you for your gift and for your guidance what does dear leo need to know <clears throat> The wisdom of the old soul, where is it guiding her? I feel like there's a female out there getting messages from spirit. Somebody knows it's time to lay a connection down, but you haven't budged. In the near future, you will be single. And somebody is pregnant. Somebody needs to get back to pray or meditate on things somebody's family situation is not altogether correct so you want to change that i just feel like it's time for you to stop trying to see how you can make it work with this one person it could be a gemini a libra and aquarius it doesn't have to be but the knight of swords that's at the top of your brain dear leo this person could be a chaser or a runner also in a situation. I feel like the old soul, the crone, is coming into a new perspective on this. Could be dealing with an Aries for some of you. Okay, I just see Aries at the bottom of the Zizek, okay? But dear Leo, what, what's important to note here is that you're coming into wisdom. You're coming into knowledge. You're not accepting things any longer. Okay, Google. Turn east to white. You're not with the with the frivolous. You're ready to cut someone off for good. You're tired of making it work. Dragon, beware of self-delusion. Many of you are waking up. Nest, an emotionally secure, loving family is important to you. It's important to you, but you haven't felt secure lately, dear Leo. Many of you are pondering if your present relationships are for you any longer or if you should even harp on this one person that you used to love. Oh, the Leo. Could have been a perfect match at some point. Cactus, heart, garden. But now, things are getting prickly. Gamble. Somebody's taking a risk. And you're not here for it. A chain of events is about to affect your life, dear Leo. If you stay in this situation any longer. Dark man. It says dealings or relationships with a man with dark complexion or hair. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mentally. I do feel like you're walking away. This Ten of Wands came out as your recent past, Leo. For many of you, there was an emotional disconnect that occurred recently, okay? Even if you are sleeping with the person who this reading is about, there was an emotional disconnect because you don't trust somebody any longer. I'm seeing that many of you need to meditate. As a final outcome... You truly need to come into union with source, with spirit, so that you can get your signs because there is something off here in a family situation or with your domestic partners, with your lovers. Broom, you got a new home and a new attitude on your mind. You are very passionate in this season to make things right. You're not accepting or settling. Taurus season provides stabilizing energy, Leo, and I feel like you and yours need something to change drastically. Again, some of you could be dealing with a dark man in some way, shape, or form. 
It is important right now to take a step back and spend some time alone. Instead of placing your focus on another, now is the time to give to yourself. Many of you are being called to separate. This is why you decided to block this person and you also got healing. It says, imagine yourself and your beloved surrounded by light. Feel your relationship being healed this very moment. If there's somebody that you're emotionally disconnected from, dear Leo, that could have been a perfect match. I see that it's time to stop trying to see how you can, you know, make a relationship where there is none. Somebody out there feels like they've just been holding on to nothing. This night that moves so slow, unbeknownst to you, is not going to change anytime soon. Somebody needs more and they need it now. They need commitment. They need to know that they're secure. Somebody's bringing a life into the world. Somebody already has. There are families out there where, you know, one spouse or one partner just wants to be able to trust in the other completely. But see, Leo, you've been getting messages, downloads. You've been seeing signs. You've been observing things in someone near and dear to you. Again, that could have been perfect at one point, but now it's, it's, you're questioning things. And the dragon is here saying, beware of self-delusion. It's time for you to spit fire, spit your truth. This enlightenment that you're receiving, these, this knowledge that you have about your partner right now, I feel like this is what's bringing in this single contentment and joy in the near future. The fact that your partner is slipping and thinks you can't do better for yourself. And when you prove them wrong, how happy you'll be. Many of you have already escaped unions that were so bad for you. Look at this. You're on a journey. This is your present energy card. You're on a journey. A lot of you are leaving places. It could be workplaces. It could be churches. It could be, uh, you know, places of worship. It could be community organizations. It could be the gym. It could be any group setting. You guys are kind of disconnecting. You see things differently now. You believe in different things now. Things have been exposed to you, Leo, that you can't pretend like you don't know or you don't feel tugging at your heartstrings about people, places, and things around you. Your involvements are getting completely difficult. You want to know that you're safe. You don't want to keep your heart guarded. Let's get... A wild offering. Dear Leo, this could be about anything at all, but I feel like you're here because spirit has something to tell you. If you feel like you have to walk away or that you're on this journey alone, you're not. You're just walking into a destiny that was meant for you. Divine timing is at play. It says the divine brings things in the timing that we need. Nothing comes before we're prepared, nor leaves too early. So if you feel like getting the, the step in, if you've gotten the step in, give yourself a pat on the back. Because what? Because nothing comes before we're prepared. So if you find yourself packing, then that means you're ready for the next phase. May I always trust your perfect and holy timing, dear Lord, it says. Thank you, Holy Spirit, on behalf of Leo. Leo's in love, coming into wisdom. You don't need the person you thought you did, especially not the way they're carrying on, right? Death, transformation is here. Three of Pentacles, collaboration is here. Ten of Cups, contentment and joy is here. Look, let the ending happen. You're going to be working somewhere else. You're going to be joining with someone else, joining resources, combining resources with somebody worthy, dear Leo. Ten of Cups, this is going to be your soulmate. Contentment and joy. If you are single, what's coming in in love? May 2021 for dear Leo. Thank you, Holy Spirit. If they were led here. 
past life. Somebody from your past life, dear Leo, could be in the mix again, once again. But we see 10 of cups here this time. Yeah, you've been facing obstacles, especially if it's somebody from your past life who you might have faced plenty of obstacles with, okay? This is somebody that this reading could be about, okay? Just as confirmation. But look, destiny, yes. Divine timing and destiny are at play here. You have the hand of God reaching out one more for dear Leo. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Beauty queen. And you're feeling good about yourself, overcoming these obstacles. Look, the, the, the freaking reward is sweeter when it was hard to come by. Ain't that right, dear Leo? Romance angels advice for those who are in union. Stay optimistic about your love life, folks, and keep an open mind. It says your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. You guys are walking away from somebody because there's somebody wonderful, okay, on the horizon for you. Dear Leo, I hope you claim this message or any on the channel by giving it a thumbs up. Just had to segue that, but keep an open mind, honeys. I feel like you are too wise, <laughs> too grown, who am I reading for to carry on and deal with the same nonsense and not get enough and not feel like your heart is big and full every day and not feel like you're getting the attention you deserve? Go where you are appreciated, not ignored. Dear Leo, whoo, I love y'all heart and soul before we part. Holy Spirit, how can you speak into the heart and soul of dear Leos everywhere? on their journeys to a proper destiny to a true soulmate divine timing of course confirmed at play it's time to you know show people that you don't need <laughs> their lack of attention you don't need the insecurities you feel when you're with them <laughs> who am i reading for dear leo it says Something will be revealed in a dream or through someone you trust. The information sheds light on something that has remained hidden from you for some time. Mm. Suddenly, the missing piece of a puzzle appears and you are able to see the bigger picture. You are getting a download soon. You're getting a download about a person, place, or thing at present that you're going to freaking leave behind. Dear Leo, Ten of Cups, Contentment, and Joy is your destiny. I hope you claim this reading. I do love you all. Don't be afraid to peace out whoever needs to be peaced out. Oh dear Leo, beware of self-delusion. Embrace the contentment and joy. Drop the loser, love yourself, and boom, here comes your new boo. I hope you're claiming it. 2021 is not over. Be blessed. <laughs> Peace.